London is my city. London is my safe space. I remember walking down the streets in London and just feeling so incredibly amazed that there were so many people like me. And for the first time, I felt like I really belonged somewhere. I'm lucky enough to be from New England. The places that I'm from, the experiences that I had there always felt safe to me. I'm very lucky. It's very rare to be able to say that. You know, my safe space would be my own home because uh, ever since I was a kid, I didn't have to come out of the closet because my parents and my sisters, they fully supported me and accepted me for who I am. Troop 429 is a gay bar and performance space in Norwalk, Connecticut. It's kind of like one of those places where you walk in there, nobody really pushes to understand pronouns. I am proud to be an ally. In India, people rarely speak about the LGBTQ plus topics, but this is changing with the support Faxit has enabled. The ecosystem is coming together for this community here in India. Mindset is changing, laws are changing, and Faxet wants to be a catalyst for these changes. We must keep the transgender community in the conversation, especially Black trans women who are experiencing violence and discrimination at alarming rates. We must protect them. We must make sure that they can experience the same freedoms that so many can because of their efforts. You don't have to have your guard up with me. You can bring your whole self. You have a place in our society, and you have a place in our table. You're not alone. You do belong. I come from a place of privilege. I understand that. I get that. And it's my obligation to get involved in order to try and take my place of privilege and create change for others. To everyone in our LGBT plus community, FactSet stands proudly with you, no matter where in the world you are. With us, you are safe to bring your full and authentic self to work, I'm here to support you. The global leadership team is here to support you. Happy Pride. My daughter's first love was a girl. My daughter's current love is a boy. And it doesn't matter. I always tell her as long as they treat you well and they respect you and they honor you and you enjoy their company, that's all that matters when you love someone.